Hello everyone, if you have hired new employees and you want to show them the hierarchy and reporting relationships within the company, then creating an organizational chart in Excel from a list is the best option for you. With the help of this chart, one can quickly grasp the structure of the company and understand the roles of their colleagues and superiors. This reduces confusion and helps to integrate new hires more smoothly. It can be also used for decision making, project management, training and development new projects. So this is Jihad Jim from Excel Demi and today we'll learn several methods on how to create an organizational chart in Excel from a list. So let's talk about what is an organizational chart. In simple words, an organizational chart is a diagram where the hierarchy of an organization is depicted. It also helps us to understand the chain of command of the organization as well as the flow of the information. Before going into the methods, let's talk about the dataset a bit. Here we have the whole hierarchy of an organization and we want to create an organizational chart with the help of this data set. For this tutorial, I'll be using Microsoft Excel 365. So without any further discussion, let's get started. In our first method, we'll be using Smart Art Design feature to create an organizational chart. Now, at first, we'll go for the Insert tab. In the Illustrations, we'll go for Smart Art feature. Now, in the Choose a Smart Art graphic, we'll go for the Hierarchy and select Organization Chart. Click OK to get the organization chart here. After that, you'll go for the Type Your Text here. Press Ctrl plus A to select all the text and delete the manual values. Now, you need to insert your chart from the list. So, select the list which is from B5 to B17. Press Ctrl plus C to copy it. Now go for the smart art feature. In the type your text here, you'll go for Ctrl plus V to paste all the proper value from the list. As we are trying to create an organization hierarchy, so we need to show the hierarchy here. So at first, the highest position will be the president position. Now to show that the VPHR is reporting to the president, we need to go for the VPHR and then go for Smart Art Design tab. And here you will find the demote option. Click on the demote one time so that it will show the VPHR is reporting to the president. But now, if you want to show that the staff is reporting to VPHR, then you need to go for the Smart Art Design tab again. You need to click Demote for two times. After that, you need to do the same for the recruitment and department. Suppose the recruitment and department are reporting to staff, then you need to press Demote for three times. Then you will see that it is showing perfectly. Now, if we want to show the VP Finance is reporting to President directly, then you have a very good shortcut. Suppose you don't like to go for the Smart Art Design or the Remote option, then you can easily use the keyboard option here. Just press the tab in the keyboard for one time and it will do the same like the remote. Again, if you want to show that the accounts is reporting to the VP Finance, then press tab for two times. Go for the treasury and again press tab for two times to show that treasury is also reporting the VP finance. You can select accounts and tax department and then press tab for the three times to show that the accounts department and tax department is reporting to the treasury. After that, if you want to do the same for the VP marketing is reporting to the project manager, then press tab for one time and after that the customer service and sales is reporting to the VP marketing. So we'll press tab for two times. So that's how you have created an organization chart from a list by using the Smarter Design tab. In our method, we want to create an organization chart from a list by using Visual Data Visualization Add-in. At first, we'll go for the Insert tab. Then in the Add-ins, we'll go for Insert and Add-in. Click on it to open Office Add-ins. Here you'll select the Microsoft Visual Data Visualizer. Then here you'll find the Add option. Click on the Add option, create the data visualization dialog box, go for the organization chart and in the hybrid, go for the create. And now it will create a diagram here. To change the diagram here, you need to go for the table here. In the table, if you change the name, 
Lisa Paul. You can also change the title from manager to assistant. And here in the role type, you will also find the assistant. Now you will see that you have changed the row 6 here. Here is the previous data. Let's click on the refresh button and see whether the change happened or not. Click on the refresh and see the change has happened. So that's how you can easily use the data visualizer according to your wish. Now we want to show you something special. To do that we have already created the chart in our previous methods. So at first we will select the chart and then we'll go for the smart art design tab click on it and now you'll find smart art styles if you want to change the styles here you can select any of the styles here in this chart if you want to get this kind of chart or create the 3d chart you can do any of that according to your wish suppose we have to change the chart like this you want to change the color of any nodes then select the certain color node Go for the change colors and here in the colorful section you will find many colors. Select the colors and then you will see the change here in the chart. Now if you want to change the layout also then go for the layout in the smarter design. Click on it and select the proper layout according to your wish. Here if you click on it then you will see that you have created the proper change here. So that's it for today. You can follow these methods accordingly or you can download the practice workbook from the link below. Hope this will help you. If you have any questions, suggestions or feedback please let us know in the comment section. Or you can have a glance at excelemy.com. Thanks for watching our video. If you like this video please consider subscribing for more content like this.